ultra-processed foods could play a role in depression. CBS 17's Liz Ortiz is here now with a closer look at this research. Liz. Well, Rod Angela, researchers found that consuming ultra-processed foods, especially those with artificial sweeteners, increase the risk of depression. Frozen meals, soft drinks, fast food, cookies, and packaged snacks may taste good, but research shows those ultra-processed foods can be bad for your health. A study out of Harvard Medical School discovered a possible link to depression. This is no surprise. There is a connection between our mood and the foods that we eat. What we eat every day is a daily investment in how we feel. Psychologist Dr. Susan Albers with the Cleveland Clinic wasn't part of this study, but she says when a person eats ultra-processed foods, it triggers a spike in dopamine. The good feeling can also add to the cravings. But participants in the study who consumed ultra-processed foods, particularly artificial sweeteners and artificially sweetened beverages, were at higher risk of depression. It's a link researchers continue to study. While there is a link between depression and ultra-processed foods, we can't say that there is a causal link. People who are depressed may reach for ultra-processed foods because they are comforting and convenient. When you are feeling depressed, you may not have the energy to shop, prepare, or cook food. Dr. Albers suggests choosing fruits, nuts, or seeds over ultra-processed snacks. And also be sure to read labels. If there is an ingredient you can't pronounce, it may be best to avoid it. Guys. Very good advice. All right, Liz, thank you.